guys. Now I want to take you on a journey through a lot of footage I recently took. It was about a month ago that I went to uh, Phuket. Now it's the first time I've ever been there. Um, Southeast Asia. I've been to Hong Kong before. But that's it. Um, it's traditional for, you know, a lot of Australian people to, to travel to Thailand. Um, because it's very cheap to get over there. It costs about the same to go from Perth to uh, Southeast Asia as it does to go from Perth to Sydney. So, um, I really wanted to get away. It was just after Christmas and, you know, you just need a break from everything. So, I started shooting as you do. Um, shooting out at the clouds. And now you get a real sense of what kind of, like, surroundings It's like a emerald green, and um, it's very humid over there. It's I it didn't rain at all when I was there, and I'm not sure what season it was. Maybe I don't know. Sorry. No. It was very humid. Like you would get outside and. It wasn't like an exhausting heat like you would experience in the desert, uh, what I'm very accustomed to. Um, it's more, I don't know, it doesn't make you exhausted, that's, that's all I can say. You still have the energy to move around, but you are like literally sweating buckets of sweat. over there. So I spent about a week just in Phuket. I, I was thinking about going to Bangkok, but um, I, I couldn't be bothered really, like, because I arranged everything by myself. Uh, I went through booking.com to choose the hotel, and I was very hesitant at first because I wasn't sure if, you know, buying uh, hotel accommodation in from a website in another country, you know, and the, the price was much lower than what, uh, like, our local flight centers were offering, so I was a bit cautious, but it all turned out fine. I didn't get there, and they didn't know who I was, and everything like that. Okay. So what I'm going to show you in these videos is a lot of um, touristy attractions. Um, what we are seeing now is, uh, it's called the Monkey Cave. Um, I think it's a temple of some sort. Excuse me, I'm very tired. Um, and I can't stop yawning. Yeah, this was, I think it's called the Monkey Cave and the Monkey Temple. And it's, it's filled with like gold statues. And um, there's a lot of uh, monkeys milling around everywhere. And the, it's okay to go up to them and feed them, but uh, once they bite you, say, like, it's a long way to the hospital, and who knows what kind of diseases the, the monkeys carry.
rises uh, this rock formation that's really weird. It's just like a upside down uh, rock that's just jutting out of the water in the middle of uh, a lagoon, I think you might be able to call it that. I don't know for sure. The thing, uh, they didn't really tell you much um, in regards to what you're seeing. That's kind of one of the downsides of um, the tours over there. They don't explain anything about the history. It's like 